Hello, my name is Andy and I am the Village Idiot, a man with a car and a GoPro and an unhealthy amount of time on my hands. Welcome back to the district of North East Derbyshire and you find me this morning lent against the nice stone wall here in a place called Wadshelf, which is just one of the many settlements in this parish to the west of Chesterfield. Welcome to the parish of Brampton. most part in this one the camera is going to spend a lot of time on the dashboard of the car because it's so spread out and the settlements within Brampton Parish are all dotted around and it's it's not easy to walk around them I'm just about to head to the car to move on towards our next sort of place where I'm going to get out and walk but I just noticed this footpath and there's a cracking view up here so I'm going to walk up here and show you what I can see right now
Okay, so now we're in Old Brampton Village and it's this village that the parish takes its name from. There's an area of Chesterfield called Brampton, doesn't fall within these parish boundaries. And as urban sprawl has taken over uh, the town of Chesterfield, obviously Brampton has expanded out towards the Old Brampton, but it's important not to get them mixed up. Uh, and there isn't really much along this road. It's just basically one road and I'm gonna walk as far down as I feel necessary and then walk back again and then we're off to Linica Reservoirs. I'll tell you what, it's not hard to see why people love Derbyshire as a county when there's villages like this in it. What a fantastic place this is. Lovely, absolutely lovely. Okay, so in the center of the parish, there are three reservoirs called Linica reservoirs. And here is a nice little map showing them for you. There's an upper reservoir, a middle reservoir, 
and a lower reservoir and I believe I am there in this car park here and there's, as you can see there's plenty of trails around plenty of ways to walk around them I'm not going to spend too long here because we've all seen reservoirs before and we've all seen trails before on the channel uh, so what I'm going to do I'm just going to walk down to the lower reservoir possibly across to the middle one as well have a quick look at them both and then we'll move on to Cutthorpe I'll tell you what, the reservoirs are nice, but they're in a valley and uh, quite a steep valley at that. I mean, it's good for the legs, good workout for the legs, I suppose. But uh, yeah, after a while, if you do come down here, you do start to get a little bit worn out quite quickly. Right, now I need to move on to Cutthorpe. Now, Cutthorpe is just like Old Brampton in that it's all laid out along one road. So the GoPro will go onto the dashboard for a lot of this, however, there are some bits I want to get out of the car for, uh, so it's going to be kind of a mixture.
So the last part of this video will see me driving from here in Cutthorpe back up into Upper Newbold on the border with Chesterfield. There are a few other little hamlets that are out to the west of Cutthorpe and obviously to the west of Brampton Parish. If there's anything I've missed out there, it may well be included in today's picture bit. And if it's not, I'm sure you guys can let me know about it. Speaking of the picture bit, here it comes. And there you go, that's the parish of Brampton. A very, very difficult one to film. I've had to use the car a lot in this episode, so thank God I've got one, and thank God I can drive it. Because <laughs> otherwise, I don't think I would have managed this one on foot. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it, it's one of those that's spread out all over the place. It's a bit like Alt Hucknall, that episode in Bolsover that we did not so long ago. Um, so yeah, but some are like this. Some are towns, some are nice villages to walk around and some are like this. But that's the challenge I've set myself. So this is it for today and I shall see you next week again in North East Derbyshire. But for now, I've been Andy, also known as the Village Idiot, and I'm out.